Hello, Jesse Good here, and today I'm reviewing Kendall Lloyd, my first Lego Ninjago movie set. This is actually a poly bag of an exclusive figure. The little code down there implicates that there's a Lego Ninjago movie game coming out. I'm pretty sure this is the pre order bonus for that game. And you can see on the back there's a nice cool design. Can't wait to get the other sets, but for now, let's take a look at that minifigure. So here is Kendall Lloyd. The exclusive parts are his helmet, um, which actually has a black design to it, and then the gold finish for the little kind of railings right there, which look fantastic. I mean, that's the first time we're getting the Kendo helmet in that design. And then his black little uh, breastplate right there is actually a very hard to find color for that piece because it only came in one set in 2000, which was a Lego Ninja set in that color. So you might as well call that exclusive because it's pretty darn hard to get. Uh, this design for this little staff is kind of basic, but let's remove all that so we could get a look at uh, the 2017 Lego Ninjago movie Lloyd figure. Because cool enough, they also give you a hairpiece to put on him. So you don't need that Kendo look. And yes, finally, I have my hands on a Lego Ninjago movie figure early. This looks fantastic. I can't wait to get the rest of the figures. Lloyd actually has these green eyes that kind of separate him from a lot of other Lego minifigures because Lego minifigures in general don't have colored eyes. They did it a little bit back in the day. They, like for 2008, they had a, a Indiana Jones figure with blue eyes. They had a few of those. but. Uh, I'm kind of glad they stopped it, and then they brought it back for Lloyd, which, you know, I can kind of understand. They want to make the main character look really unique. Maybe it plays into the story as well. Love the hair piece right here. This is a great hair molding. This comes in a lot of sets, so it's not really exclusive or anything like that, but uh, very cool to get in here. And right here, he has a very angry-looking face, which uh, fits well with the hair. And, of course, he does have his symbol on the back. So overall, can't wait to get the rest of the figures. So glad that I was able to get this guy a little bit early. And uh, the outfit for the torso and legs, I believe, are the same that come in all the other uh, Lego Ninjago movie sets with uh, Lloyd in his ninja outfit. So it's really just his ninja outfit. But that's it for this poly bag, um, except there's one last thing, which is a little instructions, which isn't much of instructions. So you can see this little fold out for the instructions, very complicated instructions right there. <laughs> Um, but love the designs and everything because this implicates that the instructions will probably have this nice kind of uh, old burnt paper design. You can see B Ninja with uh, Lloyd and it says Lego the Ninjago movie. Um, you can't A Ninja, you've got a B Ninja. And then right here is a little poster, the Ninjago movie. And it shows all the characters and their ninja outfits and then Garmadon just looking over the city. But you can see they condense that city into that one nice direct to consumer Ninjago City set, which is a great modular type building. So that's it for this review. Hope you guys enjoyed it, and I will see you guys later. Peace out. Bye.